Hello guys, this is Aldi and you are watching my YouTube channel, Algen Civil Engineering. Today guys, we are going to talk about how to compute the weight of steel. As civil engineers, there are instances that we need to compute the weight of steel. But before we start, make sure you like this video and press the subscribe button so that you'll get updated in my future videos. Okay guys, let's start. So as you can see here guys, I have here the standard weight of 1 meter steel bar so this portion here are the sizes of the steel bar so we have 6 millimeter 8 millimeter 10 millimeter and so with other sizes 12 16 20 and 25 millimeter diameter steel bar this portion here are the weight of the steel bar per meter length for example for 6 millimeter steel bar one meter length of that steel bar is equivalent to 0 0.22 kilogram for 8 millimeter steel bar one meter length of that is equivalent to 0 0.39 kilogram for 10 millimeter steel bar one meter length of that is equivalent to 0 0.62 kilogram and so with the other sizes of steel bars so we have 0 0.88 for 12 millimeter 1.58 kilogram for 6 mil 16 millimeter 2.47 kilogram for 20 millimeter and 3.86 kilogram for 25 millimeter and as you can see guys, if we have already this value, we can already compute the weight of the steel bar. So we just follow this formula. Weight is equal to the weight of the steel bar per meter length times the length of the steel bar being used and multiplied to the quantity of the steel bar. Regarding the length of the steel bar, we have different length of the steel bars that we can purchase in the hardware. So we have 6 meters, 7.5 meters. 9 meters, 10.5 meters, 12 meters, and also there is a special length that you can request to cut 13.5 meters and also 15 meters. So the value of this L in this formula depends upon the the length of this being used. So I have here guys an example problem so that we will know how to compute the weight of steel. So find the total weight of the steel bars for 100 pieces 10 mm diameter steel bar at 6 meter length 50 pieces 12 mm diameter steel bar at 6 meter length and 25 pieces 6 10 mm diameter steel bar at 7.5 meter length now if we are going to use the formula uh, weight is equal to the weight of the steel bar per meter length times the length times the quantity so for 10 millimeter diameter steel bar if we are going to compute the weight for 10 millimeter diameter steel bar so we have 0 0.62 which uh, this one 0 0.62 10 times 6 which is the length of the steel bar 6 meter length times the quantity 100 pieces so it will give us a total of 372 kilogram and for the 12 millimeter diameter steel bar so 0 0.88 times 6 times 50 so this 0 0.88 comes from here here and uh, 6 meters comes from here and 50 so if you are going to multiply that we will have a total weight of 264 kilogram the same also with 16 mm diameter steel bar so 1.58 times 7.5 times 25 so this 7.5 comes from here the length of the steel bar and 1.58 comes from here so if we are going to get the sum of this uh, steel bar so we will have a total weight of 932.25 kilogram so as you can see guys it is uh, very easy to compute the weight of the steel bar if we only have these values you know. so it's very easy but assuming if we forget those values we can still get the weight of the steel bar by this formula weight is equal to d squared over 162 where d is the diameter of the steel bar in millimeter so for example guys <coughs> we are going to compute the weight of the steel bar now uh, 1 meter length of steel bar for 6 mm so weight is equal to d squared divide 162 so 6 squared 
divide 160 is equal to 0.22 kilogram. As you can see guys here, 0.22 is the same here, 22. And another example for uh, 8 millimeter steel bar, so W is equal to D squared divide 162. So 80 squared divide 162 is equal to 0 0.39 kilogram. And this 0 0.39 is the same as here. So guys, if you forget these values here, you know, uh, we can still use this formula and we can still uh, compute the weight of the steel bars. So that's it guys. No? So we know already how to compute the weight of the steel bars. And if you find this video very helpful, no? Uh, like this video and in my next video i will show to you guys how this uh, formula is being derived and uh, thank you guys for watching my video and see you in my next video